What's up guys, this is the Rifleman and I am back to bring the next episode of my Empire Total War Let's Play as the United States. So the runoff up at last time, uh, we landed an army off the coast of India with the hope of ideally trying to garrison this settlement, um, but they have intercepted us, so we are assaulting this settlement, which actually is going to be pretty good because they're going to get reinforcements from Ahmadnagar, um, but they do not get their garrison bonus and they have not got any mortars so i think this would be pretty good so let's attack one thing i have to be ready for is i may pitched battle before i get to doing the attack because they will be coming in um i need to unless unless i can do some shenanigans during deployed battle before i can attack the city unless i deploy deploy to the right in which case they may decide to go into the city So my assumption is that they will come in from over here somewhere. So I might redeploy. That's a lot of crewmen. So I deploy some guns here. And then let's do... F effectively deploy something like this. Very stupid, not very smart. But the idea is I want a flexible position if they decide they want to come in from one of the flanks. Then let's deploy, deploy my howitzers, all firing quick line. Some massive units of cavalry, 219 men. Deploy my lancer guards. Bring in my general. So bring them all down rapidly. Ooh, you know foot artillery that's not in a terrible position. Get these guys to pick at the corner. Oh, they're sallying out. Oh, wowzers. Limber. Okay, let's take these guys and try and deploy them into a consistent front line. Let's move up my cavalry. There we go. Let's do... Let's do shrapnel shot on a point. Hope from square. Be it. That might be it from the from the Sally. Let's bring one of them in to hit the lances. Oh, I should just use my infantry to do it. 
I need to deploy my cavalry to engage their cavalry. Killing lots of cavalrymen over here. Okay, here comes some of the first infantry units. Ch charge straight on into the Hindu warriors. Actually, maybe pull back. Hindu warriors can get shot to pieces. Good, so that's the horsemen taken care of. to shot the musketeers. So that's enticed the cavalry to charge in, which means I can now free up another unit to do fire by rank. Okay, attack the Hindu warriors because it looks like they're trying to go for my my artillery. Islamic swordsmen. If you guys were reloaded, that would be lovely. Ooh, that's a... There's a, there's a, a okay, you're all hitting in the centre. Good, they're all routing. Oh. Let's start the assaults, because my... Quick climb houses are doing an excellent job of attacking the city. Let's move these guys up. These guys are slowly going to enter the field. Some houses focus on. Infantry guards holding the breach. So let's redeploy the cavalry. Let's hit the lancers. Let's cause them to rout. Because these guys could come back. Let's maybe do something like this my reserve unit to make sure they don't but they're about to actually leave good some other lances are coming in These guys get shot to pieces already. Good stuff. Uh, 
a round shot quick climb doesn't really make much difference. These guys all form square. So whoever they fancy a charge at. Oh, that was not good. Neither was that. That was even worse. <laughs> All my guys fire it all off. Oh no, don't charge him in then. Dakali dervishes. units is pretty bad. So run in, so at least with these guys here they can provide more fire support against units that may want to re-enter the battlefield. Well, not re-enter the battlefield, but you know, come back. She's got utterly destroyed. They're facing the wrong way. infantry in there to support. I think that's it. I think they have been... reinforcing armies have been destroyed. Good stuff. So let's redeploy my army over here. See how many continental marines they kill. None. They might kill some of my troops here. Okay, let's run. Because we're starting to... in. How do my guys fare against resistant to morale sharks? Good stamina. Well they're just m killing more of their own men I would assume. See how lancers deal with elephants. Okay. Let's 
screw it. This is a bad idea, but why not? You guys in. There we go. Now we're starting to cut them down. Good. Charge into the flank of the dervishes. Hiya! General taken care of. Spin my infantry around. Let's get my lances on the. Whew, good. So you fought them on the open field, killed their reinforcements, and I think we rebuild the walls because these guys now are really in a delicate position. Oh no! Sir, we can take the fort. That's something at least. Because I'm not going to move on an attack against Satara. Um, I want to draw them into. draw some of these stacks into my territory. Where I can wear them down. Okay, hop back up to. Uh, against the Russians. To be honest, I think these guys are now extremely surplus to requirements, so. You. Oh, you're an, you're an enemy one, that's why. Start to recruit some ships to sail these guys around to Jerusalem to then cross. Well, to be honest, they just sail straight to the theatre, I think. Let's bring these guys to bottle up the Russian fleet, just to make sure they don't think about getting up to any tricks. Uh, Storakum. You're replenishing, but you're going to fall back. Short Lincoln, fullback. Hadwin Arnold. Yeah, don't worry about that. Trade related, don't worry, don't worry, don't worry. Fallback. Peter Payne. Move up and engage the remaining Russian army in Finland. A couple of armies per city against the Indians, and then just squeeze on every coastline, all towards the centre. Although, bearing in mind, we do have loads of troops up near Afghanistan, so it'd be nice to open up some fronts to help, or to persuade them to spread their army out a bit more. Because right now we're at four armies there, so that's quite a lot of troops. Okay. Peter Payne. Set my armies up. Good old 12 pounders. Infantry and two lights. Infantry and two lights on this flank. Infantry and two lights on this flank. The colonial dragoons on each flank. Quick climb. Quick climb. General. Ooh, one ho one hit on that horse artillery unit, they're all dead. <laughs> There's one guy manning the gun. Two units of light horse, so let's just stop to advance my light foot on the flank. Okay. 
haven't really got a... Ooh, that was a pretty good shot. So the reinforcing armies... Yeah, they're going to be the same as before. They're not really going to have... Not really going to have much going for them. So get these guys just to, just to destroy this footline unit. Because they've not really got much option to do anything else. Pretty advanced these guys up. Let's get these chaps to start to... This artillery battery on the right start engaging new flank. Let's send these guys in to the foot line or the line infantry. Whoop, some light infantry have exposed themselves. Okay, let's retarget my artillery. Good. Then let's just do a general advance. If they want to be tricky, they can be tricky. Okay, so the cavalry is charging my light infantry, but to be honest, they've done such a good job that if they reload, they can probably destroy these units before they even get to them. If my long riflemen reload, reload, fire. Oh no, I thought you'd reloaded. Goons out there because right now they're just providing. They're just getting. They're just in a, a good position to be shot by friendly fire. Afraid, blunderbuss shotgunners, you're going to be very upset. With regiment of horse, that's my light infantry aren't following; they're just here. General's been killed. stuff. Yep, you guys are going to be in a tricky position. So you got the massed firepower of the line infantry being supported by accurate rifle fire from the long rifle. Yeah, you don't really have much of a hope, do you? Goons, line infantry, 32 pounders. Send my cover on some scouting expeditions. I bring up my general up to this hilltop. 
one blunderbuss shotgunner. A blunderbuss shotgunner might get shot to pieces by my Cossacks. Especially if I run them. Fire round shot, even though my, my houses are pretty far behind the line. Knock out the artillery. Everyone just keep moving up. So let's move you guys up. Good, they did which they did route. So let's bring you all along like this. See, they're all falling back because they know my, my cavalry is in the is in their lines and they, they think that that's the best thing to do and it's just not but to be honest there is no best thing to do they are being attacked in every direction Although, to be honest, there's probably not going to be much in it, so I might even just turn my artillery off. Just charge in. Chop. Turn off fire at well. That's going to be it, I think. Let's get the foot guards in to support my cavalry. Although they're probably going to be... Let's get my dragoons in against the com in into the combat against the Tsar guards before the infantry get involved. Good, just making sure that army on the corner of the map wasn't a reinforcing army. Yeah, you should be shaken. And you should be concerned with enemies nearby. Because do you see how many enemies are nearby? Loads of them! Oh, that guy just stabbed one of my horses. Wow. Lovely, decisive victory. And then soon this will be end of the Russian faction as we know it. Good stuff. Well, that is the end of the. Well, that's the end of Russian forces in Finland. Lovely. So let's get you to gar get ready to raid this port. You guys can just figure out what you're still going to do. Um, So let's get. Yes. And you can't get inside yet. Cool. I'm going to hit enter and see what happens. Yeah, my armies that are moving on the Plains of Nations. Ah, oh, I forgot to move up my damn 
So I've got an army in Basra that's ready to move. So I may, I may land them. Okay, so they've garrisoned the city. Okay. I'm... Oh yeah, so they are on the move to Algiers. <laughs> the Russians are going to do whatever the Russians can do, what little they can do. Oh, there's a region up in Finland. Forgot about that. Not Finland. Norway. There is a degree of unrest in this region, as the majority. Yeah, I can imagine. You guys are still figuring your stuff out. You're still on the move. Leave this cottage. You take out that annoying little. That little pack of scamps sent up my infantry ahead to finish them off. We are mighty and ah, damn. More order. That's ready, sir. Forward. You bring up the rear. Cavalry can't pursue them, sadly. Hey, wait a minute! You look like Peter Payne, but you're Leslie Oliver. Oliver, Olivier. You guys keep reinforcing, so. This is a ship, sir. Ship's orders at the ready. Yes, Captain. So sir. get aboard. Yes, Captain, sir. Get Captain aboard. Sir. Besiege the port. The Russians have no. Well, they have. Well, they do have a navy. This is true. So I have to be careful with him. Great out heavy first rate to a new fleet. So when we prepare for the when we prepare for the breakout, we need to be ready. So what fleet have you got? I mean it's not not bad. So I might steal some ships from the fleet at Brest to go to Portsmouth. Uh, let's try you guys. Let's try you. So you go back to the rest. This full fleet can go here to blockade the Baltic so they can't break in and destroy two of my fleets at anchor. So then down in India. So let's move the sloops out. Embark, Ulysses Dalton. Man. Let's land him. Oh, it doesn't like it. Ooh, hold on. Oh, okay, they're just going up to that port instead. Okay. I don't think it's like it's not liking this at all. very tempting to send them onwards to Satara to try to take it. Let's try get more... Okay, firstly... Let's get that sloop to take over the blockade. Blockade kind of cut. So let's get Mars aboard. Let's get this army embarked. Norbert. Norbert Jackson. So then let's take... I'm really not liking this. It's not even like letting me... Sleep. Good. Okay, so I think now is the time to land up near Bengal. So let's take Scorpion Embark. Well, let's dump him into Calcutta because Calcutta is still empty. Let's disembark the army. Let's lay siege to Calcutta. Let's take my navy 
get into here. Then let's take Mars with his army. Also get them over to Bengal to reinforce. So I don't know why it really has really certain parts of this game that my, my computer just really hates. The army, to be honest, they probably might be a better place to actually attack. Lots of lead infantry. If I just do that for now. Well, now I'm just trying to make sure I've got my everything's in the right position. These guys are all just. Okay, let's disband. Disband. I don't, don't really need them here anymore. Okie dokie, got that. I'll probably have to fight that before I before I kill all the Russians. Okay, cool. So I think my next... Well, my next action is probably going to have to be in India... So I think it's probably going to be something like taking Norbert Jackson's army and attacking the city of Calcutta. Uh, this is going to be a biggie, so I'm going to have to really abuse these howitzers to mop out to mop up their forces. But looking at the timer, I think that's the end of this part. So thanks for watching, guys. Hope you've enjoyed, and I'll see you next time for these assaults of Calcutta. Cheers, guys.